Hi, guys. Yes, it is me. It is I, Mokonzi. And yes, this is Just Us People. I'm going to let my course please introduce yourself. Hi. Hello, guys. I'm Shadia. Welcome to Just Us People. We're blessed to have you here. Thank you for pressing play. So today we have something amazing, an amazing subject, super juicy. It's hot right now as we're speaking. So I'm going to let Shadia again introduce it for us and let's go. <laughs> All right, guys. Today is October 4th, 2021. Um, and since about 12 noon, there has been outages on four media platforms, so four social media platforms. So Facebook is down, Instagram is down, WhatsApp is down, and Facebook Messenger is down. Now, for a lot of us, we use at least one of those things on a daily basis, right? So I've been, um, I guess I'm six hours clean from them. <laughs> uh, but anyway, yeah, so we use those things on a daily basis. And today we just kind of want to talk about what happens when social media shuts down. Like what, what happens next? Thank you so much, Shadia. Yes, it's down. The world just shut down. A lot of us, that's our entire world. That's everything for us. That's our lives. That's where we have our friends. We don't have real friends. That's where our friends stay, you know? So uh, this is an incredible moment today. It's just epic. And we're just going to react about this and see how we both think about it and uh, come together and talk about it. This platform is a platform for you, for the people. That is why it's called Just people it is for your thoughts your opinions to be shared together to show differences that bring us together this platform is about love unity and just being stronger growing together learning wisdom we're hoping we're giving you guys some wisdom and a little bit of expertise here or there but before we jump in, before Shadia just hits it, we're going to be asking you guys to please like, comment, subscribe. And when you subscribe, don't forget to turn on the notification bell and also share. Share with that button and share just word of mouth to everyone. That's the way we are able to touch the world. All right, guys, enough. Let's go in. All right. All right. Thank you so much, Makonzi, uh, for reminding our followers to support us in every way possible. That is how we continue to thrive and continue to do this for you guys. So the social media, I was actually over here when you were talking, scratching a little bit, because I'm really, I'm six hours into this, this no Facebook, no IG, and I am like really feeling the effects and the crazy thing is that I never realized how much I used it until it went down right so I'm in the middle of doing my homework and and most times I'm doing my homework and I'm like you know take a second and stop and go check my you know check my Facebook or check my IG or something and now I'm like uh oh huh, what do I do? do you know what I mean so anyway it's, it's what happens when social media shuts down for me is I realized how much I actually use it. And I'm actually not very happy with that. I'm, I'm a little bit bothered about how often I reached for my phone today to check and see if it was back up. <laughs> so it's like, um, it's like a subconscious thing, I think. I just grab it and I'm like, oh, okay, I'm gonna take a break from this work. Let me check this. You know, you check your text messages, but even like, let's say Messenger's down right now, right? And WhatsApp is down right now. Some people use those as their primary source of messaging. So the thing about that is I'm missing something 
on my end, but some people are not even like able to receive the text message they normally receive or communicate with certain people. Um, and so that's, it's very interesting, uh, the effect that it's had on me. Um, and then even for like our Just Us People Facebook page and Instagram page, every day before like noon, I update them. I have like a, a new little question of the day or, you know, something to kind of engage our followers. And today I wasn't able to do it. I didn't, I didn't beat it. You know what I mean? I didn't get there by noon. When it, I think I started messing up before noon. It was like 11 something when I was trying to first post. But anyway, um, yeah, I wasn't able to do that. You know, put our cool little questions, see what our users and viewers were looking into and, you know, how they think. So it's interesting. It is interesting. Um, but I think that it also forces you to, to do other things with your time, obviously. So while I'm not scrolling through Facebook or Instagram, I'm um, doing more schoolwork or I'm, I'm doing something else with that free time rather than scrolling through and seeing my notifications. So yeah, it's, it's been an interesting little break. How about you, All McConkie? Right. How's this break been affecting <laughs> 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 now you know you know we we had this conversation a little bit earlier and it was uh, very telling to me uh, that you you said something that you know uh resonated with me where you said that um you just you just found out or you're just discovering that this might just be an addiction. <laughs> so yes, uh, Facebook for a lot of us has become an addiction. I remember the days, that's how old I am. I remember the days where there was no Facebook. I, <laughs> you young ones like, like Shadia over here. <laughs> you, guys, you guys grew up with it, right? But no, for me, like, uh, go ahead. I, I think you wanted to, to say something. No, I'm laughing. I said I grew up with some, you know, MySpace and stuff. I know about the stuff before Facebook. I was little, but I was there for it. <laughs> you were there for it, huh? <laughs> Stories for other days. But <laughs> but uh, um, Facebook has become, or social media just in general, like uh, Sharia was saying, so many platforms have gone down. And for the people that rely on it, for communication, to communicate with family, to communicate with even even work, right, co-workers, so on and so forth, uh, it is probably impacting them in a very negative way, right? Because now everyone that you've known, uh, you you've based your life around this these apps, right? Mm -hmm. And now that it's taken away from you, how do you react? what do you do right and like an addict right it's like every two seconds you got to pick up your phone and you got to check to see if it's back is it back yet you know and just like Shadia said for me I mean for me it's different but for Shadia like she was you know like checking all the, as she's working she's checking many of you guys are like that right as you work, you're checking to see who said what, how they reacted. How can you react to what they said? How can you be smarter? How can you be, you know, uh, 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 funnier? Like, what else are you watching? You're watching these shows and all these different things. And that also distracts us from what we are, we need to do, right? To, to, to be to be a proper uh, uh, contributor of just society. Now, for me, I think the positive is that without that, it's allowing you, like you said, to be able to do more, get more work done. Because every two seconds when you go back to it, for me, I don't, uh, let, let me just go back a little bit. For me, I'm not one of those people because I, I think because of the fact that I'm from the the old the older school, not the old school. You know, I'm I'm still I'm still in there. I'm still in there, guys. I, I <laughs> I'm still with some of you guys, okay. But 
um, I'm from the older school and because of that, it was never instilled in me or many of my friends, I, I would think so, where you are growing up with this thing as a way of communicating, as a way of building a personality, a, a building a, a facade, a, a, you know, just just the way you are is through that you know mm -hmm. you you go in you you see people talk about their lives you know uh the problems oh i got such and such problem you know mental health problems uh you have people that post about everything they do oh i'm eating uh you know this little this peanuts and they take a picture of the peanuts look look at my peanuts and so on and so forth okay i'm not trying to make people laugh but <laughs> i'm sorry about that but uh it's 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 telling to see that and then having to to now change that that reaction that has been done that has that has sinked in and 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 ingrained in you now you need to do things but the positive is now you're able to do more. And this is what life was about. Now you're able to go outside, look at the sun while you're drinking water, right? Now you're able to go outside and ground your feet and enjoy this planet, mama earth, right? You are able to do other things that you didn't think you were able to do. You're able to be more uh, uh, uh get more done right in the in and you you will see a difference with this right before it would take you maybe you know extra hour two hours to do a, a particular task because mm -hmm. you're on facebook every two seconds but now you're jumping in and boom there's nothing to distract you distract your attention you're fully focused there's nothing to touch your emotion to incite some some type of emotion you can just mm -hmm. lock in, get what you need need done, and then you know have time for yourself, right? Mm -hmm. And some people, I don't know if it's already back or when it's gonna be back. If it's gonna be back by the time we're finished. Do you want but, me to check real quick? I can check. You, 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 <laughs> please, Do you want me to check? I'll check. Please check as I, as I continue speaking. Okay. <laughs> so. I don't know how it's it, it it's when it's going to actually come back online, but when it does go back online, take this day, take this day off from it, fast from it, enjoy life, enjoy your loved ones, enjoy the people that are actually with you, right? You may have kids, you may have parents with you you may have friends you may have a wife girlfriend whatever get this moment to feel the difference to understand to see how it is different to put that energy that you were putting in this into something better but before i finish uh shadia what, what did you find out for us uh it's back it's back up there right yeah, i know a lot of you guys out there are like opening up champagne bottles right I'm sure when, I, when i check my facebook i'm gonna see some memes about champagne and everybody <laughs> like yeah, this weekend you guys are getting ready to go to the club because of this coming back so, yeah, it's back. guys you know we just wanted to take this moment to to capitalize on this, just to capture this, this moment where we as a people go back and have time to go back to our roots and enjoy the little things of life instead of enjoying living through a screen. A screen is not everything. People to people, we have lost that the, those, those types of relationships, a lot of us, right? We don't even know how to act anymore with one another. 
People are snapping at, at each other when they see each other. They don't know how to communicate. They don't know how to love, how to forgive, how to actually work through problems because all they know is that Facebook will help them work through those problems. They work through it through Facebook. Some people are breaking up on Facebook. Yo, I'm done with you. No. They put that up. There. <laughs> you know? No, really? <laughs> you know, some people are putting that out there. Oh, yeah, you did. I, I saw how you did me. I found you or whatever. And where is that, that personable, you know, uh, uh, culture that we used to have, that we used to share? share mm -hmm. Thank you so, so much, guys. Again, Shadia, before I go, if you have something, let us know. If not, I'm closing down. No, I just, I got to appreciate you for those reminders of how we use our time. Because now that I realize it's about myself, even, I have to reel that in. I got to do better. I got, you know, we got to challenge ourselves to do greater each day, right? And so I appreciate you, McConaughey, yes. for reminding me like do better like you know what i mean for real get off of that thing and focus on everything else that's important the people around you the things you have to do mother earth all of it so thanks so much for that reminder you always got the good stuff so i appreciate you thank you so so much shadia thank you guys out there you viewers you supporters of us you fans of us thank you so much for taking the time again and another one to sit down with us, to be here, to hear this, this conversation and to take notes. And I hope that you guys can grow from this, learn from this and took the time to reflect while this was actually happening in our lives. Mm -hmm. I don't know how many more times this will ever happen again, but this was sort of a one in a lifetime kind of moment. So I hope you enjoyed it. Again, like, subscribe, comment, and share this to everyone. And as I, as I always say, it's, it's not wanting to come out. <laughs> good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night. And everything in between thank you guys again be blessed we love you thank you thank you guys bye see you guys